2021, fire crews responded to a fire every 23 seconds across the U.S. And in order to do that life-saving work, some departments depend on help from volunteers. This National Volunteer Week, we recognize the work fire volunteers do. Joining us live to share more about the need for volunteer firefighters and support for our volunteers is Michael McLear, president of Escape. Thank you so much for being here again. Thanks for having me. Ed. Love having you on our set. So let's talk about fire volunteers. I mean, we know them. We, we thank them really for their selfless work they do. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Our call volumes are going up over the last 30 years. We've seen a dramatic increase in call volumes but the volunteerism is going down. We're all mm -hmm. busy. We've got a mm -hmm. lot of things going on in our lives, but volunteerism is still really important in many of our local communities. Here in Michigan, over 75% of fire departments rely on those volunteers who wow. are paid on call, 65% across the country. So we kind of lead the rest of the country here in Michigan. Mm -hmm. um, and there are opportunities for anybody to help volunteer. If you don't want to necessarily go in and fight that fire, it could be helping out if somebody has a motor vehicle crash. It could be going out and teaching the kids in the school about fire and life safety education, there's always opportunities. That's great. Yeah, what does it look like? Yeah, you're saying there's a wide range, a wide array of, uh, you know, well, ways that you can help out. Mm -hmm. um, what does it take and how do you kind of like get involved in, in, in something like that? Mm -hmm. So we've partnered for years with our good friends at the National Volunteer Fire Council and they have a really simple but important web page called makemeafirefighter.org. Viewers can go ahead and go right to that makemeafirefighter.org, that web page, and they can see volunteer opportunities. Fire departments can post the needs that they have and it just connects needs and resources together. So we love that and this is a great opportunity again during that National Volunteer Week to promote. It's just that simple to be able to connect everybody together and connect with the community, give back in the time that you have to be able to provide that life-saving care or just help out neighbor helping neighbor. Mm, yeah. And the need is great, right? It is great. It is great. And you know, here at Fox 17, it's exciting to expand the Pay It Forward campaign mm -hmm. with the Spotlight Awards. So if you know of someone who is doing great work in the local community, our first responders, our firefighters, EMTs, mm -hmm. it could be our healthcare professionals or even veterans, go to fox17online.com forward slash pay it forward. That's right. Yeah, we need those volunteer yeah. firefighters and we need your submissions for them because yeah. we know they're doing That's life saving right. so work every day done here. In Absolutely. Our community and we love highlighting that. So a great week, of course, to highlight the volunteer and the need right now. And we appreciate you letting us know. Yes. And, you know, because, yeah, it looks different for uh, every department. It does. It yeah. does. But like I said, we can certainly uh, help our local communities if we have somebody who's retired and they want to just give back and donate a little bit of time. There's always those opportunities there. Make me a firefighter.org. Make me a firefighter.org okay. through the National Volunteer Fire Council. Easy. Thank you, you bet. so much, Michael. Appreciate it.